Demon Slayer Hinokami Chronicles is a brand new game which means there's going to be new players who have absolutely no idea on how to play the game or they want to learn how to play the game so that they can get on rank and destroy players. Well, don't worry about that because this video, I'm going to bring you the ultimate beginner's guide to Demon Slayer Hinokami Chronicles. If you like Demon Slayer Hinokami Chronicles, then this channel is for you. So consider subscribing as we're very close to 1k. Let's begin. So as you can see, you got the health bar, you got the skill gorge, you got the assist gorge, and you got the special gorge. Just know that the health bar is shared between your assist character as well. Your goal is to deplete your opponent's health bar to nothing. The skill gorge. You can do a lot of things with the skill gorge, but I'm gonna break it down for you. So as you can see, the skill gorge has five layers. The skill gorge only depletes if you use your skills, if you dash jump or sidestep cancel during a combo and the way to charge the skill gold is by literally doing nothing yes it will literally charge it for you the assist bars you can call support or switch only two times and you have to wait until it refills the assist gauge can also be used for escaping however it takes both of the bars in the assist so use it with caution the special gauge this is used for awakening and ultimate attacks so there are three levels in the special gauge if you want to do an ultimate level one does a normal damage ultimate level two increases the damage for the ultimate and level three does a very very high damage ultimate and if you want to use the special gauge for awakenings uh for level one and level two you have something called boost in which will increase your attacks as you activate it and if you're in level three for in the special gate or level two you can go into an awakening called surge mode essentially surge is an awakening mode in which you have unlimited skills with unlimited assists and increases your damage as you combo these are the controls for basic movement These are the controls for offense. These are the controls for defense. To do a non awakened auto combo, mash square or X on Xbox. However, to do an awakened auto combo is the same thing, mash square or X on Xbox. However, it gives you an increase in damage and an extra layer of animation. Fantastic, beautiful. The up tilt combo gives you a lot of combo potential. So in order to do the up tilt combo, it's self-explanatory. All you have to do is tilt and hold the L3 button and then just mash square and it will give you an up tilt combo. Good, good, absolutely good. You're doing well. To do the down tilt combo is basically the same formula as the up tilt combo. You basically you mash square or x on xbox and you tilt and hold l3 to do the down tilt combo beautiful however if you want to take it a little bit more further and do a basic bnb combo then i got you g all you have to do is just keep parents in square and then press triangle once to do a normal bnb combo or you can combine any supers or any techniques you want within your bnb combos it's all up to you to be honest Combo limiters, they're like circle bars in which it comes in red, yellow and blue. Depending on how you start your combo, these bars kind of tell you exactly how much time you have to perform a combo before your opponent gets on a hard knockdown. The red bar indicates that your combo is going to be short. Usually if you use armor attacks, that manifests the red bar. In most cases, if you start with a regular attack, you do the normal yellow combo. This is the most common and recurring combo limiter. And lastly, if you time the parry perfectly, you'll have the opportunity to do a blue combo, also known as the long combo. So you're free to just do a long combo basically. And the most important, the most important thing you need to learn in this quick Demon Slayer Hino Kami Chronicles guide 
is to experiment and have fun because at the end of the day if you're not having fun then what's the point <laughs> and that's all for leave a comment if you want a part two to this video and don't do work on it. please like the video because this video took me like a whole day to edit subscribe if you're new as we're very close to 1k and i just call it we'll see you soon take care guys make sure you stay blessed <laughs>